Hello, I'm Marcus, and today I'm here with Manuel. And today we'll be talking about the latest news in sports. All right. First, let's go to the FA Cup. Liverpool have won the FA Cup while using their under-21 team because their whole team was basically injured. Also, Liverpool's midfield has dominated Chelsea's midfield while Chelsea has a $200 million midfield and Liverpool maybe like $50 million. And now let's go to the Premier League. And Liverpool is also topping the Premier League with 60 points. Right behind it is Manchester City with 59 and right after is Arsenal with 58. It's a very close title race in the Premier League. And now let's go to the biggest game of next week. Manchester City are playing Manchester United in the Manchester Derby at Manchester City's home. And that's it for the soccer news. Well, has just ended around three weeks ago. So off season and trade rumors and free agency is just around the corner. Starting with off season, we have the combine coming up in today. Actually, the combine starts today with uh, linebackers, if I'm pretty sure. Then. Other than that, we have the draft coming up in April, uh, trade rumors, um, as in like uh, quarterback, you know, Justin Fields and other amazing players like Kirk Cousins, um, some great players like Josh Jacobs, you know, Derrick Henry, all of them, who knows where they'll be going. That's for free agency. Some of them are on contract. Some of them are not. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a good, it's a lot of money because NFL just boosted up the salary cap. So people can spend a lot more money now. Than they, than they used to. So teams will be getting amazing players. Hopefully my team can get amazing players. Go Steelers. Please Steelers. I really hope they can get Justin Fields. I don't know if that's possible, but they might. Only the month of February, but we have one month left until the start of the regular season, which is March, around the 20th that month, that week. It will be the Los Angeles Dodgers playing the San Diego Padres in Seoul, South Korea, where it will be a two-game series, and you'll see players like Freddie Freeman and Shohei Otani, who will be putting on the Dodger uniform for the first time officially, going up against other great baseball players like Fernando Tatis. And it's, a, it's about all I could really name on that team. They're not that good anymore because they lost um, Juan Soto in free agency to the Yankees. But other than that, those is that is the latest news in sports. I'm Marcus and I'm with Manuel. And we'll be seeing you next time. Bye. Oh boy, this has nothing to do with black men. Oh. <laughs>